Welcome to Quarter Roundup. My name is Indigo. I will be taking you through this week's gaming news and some E3 sneak peeks. First off, ESL has announced the first six-figure Overwatch tournament called the Atlantic Showdown. It's going to be taking place August 20th and 21st at this year's Gamescom. There will be eight teams, four from the US and four from Europe, fighting over the $100,000 prize pool. Tryouts start June 27th, so head over to eslgaming.com. Force over at Force Gaming has actually shown us a little secret with Overwatch, that the head hitbox is almost double in height and width with characters like Genji and Hanzo with their projectile weapons. Make sure to use that little tip if you're going to take a stab at the Atlantic Showdown. Enough Overwatch news, let's get into the E3 news. We like to play a little game called Leaked or Marketing Ploy. You can go online right now and check out the Dishonored 2 trailer before it officially releases here in the US. But here's the problem. It was released in Russia and as we know what's on the internet is everywhere on the internet. Next is a snapshot of a promo poster for Injustice 2 with The Flash and Batman duking it out. This was supposed to be a promo for GameStop for anyone that pre-orders Injustice 2. How did you not know that this was going to get leaked before the game's even in stores? Next we have Dead Rising 4. It's a blurry photo of a poster or a box or all we know is it was very quickly taken and was on the floor. But shortly after this photo started circulating around, we started to see actual gameplay footage and gameplay images, even GIFs of combat coming out. So you tell me, leaked? or promo. As we talked about last week, EA and Star Wars work a lot together. I mean a lot. They decided to show off a little teaser trailer maybe? I can't really tell what it is other than them talking about how amazing Star Wars is and how they're going to do something brand new because we all know EA is known to do brand new things. But with that, we did also get to see a brand new Mass Effect trailer, and it got us going. It's absolutely amazing, guys. You have to check it out. Last but not least, we got to see the brand new Xbox One S, a 40% smaller console with a 4K resolution, a two terabyte hard drive, and a power brick that is internal. Finally. It's also white if that's your thing. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that is it for this week's Quarter Roundup. I hope you had a great time. I sure did. If you liked this video, please make sure to give us a like. And if you're new to the channel, why don't you go ahead and subscribe? We'd love to see you guys back. So until next time, guys, I'll see you in the forums.